Okay, we're going to assemble the, the rack. Uh, we're going to do the long leg first. First thing we need to uh, discuss is that uh, we have color coding. P1 and P2. Notice one is P1 is black, P2 is blue. So when we assemble, you will you will find the corresponding uh, D1 pieces uh, will match these colors. So orientate your poles. Position of that uh, was dictated by scribe lines and color. It's also important to note uh, the orientation of the poles. You can see the white strips that what we're going to tie the wire into. They are on the inside on both poles facing each other. P2 has uh, more than P1. White, white strips. I'm sorry, P2. Install a panel. One PM. This is flexible material, so you can uh, bend it. Just take care. Now another D1, black to black, and Down. Both panels in the back are the same size, so once you have the first brace, the first horizontal end, the rest of it is self-explanatory. You also notice the shiny side is, would be on, the, on, on this side or the desk side of the, of the assembly. Now that we have that far, now we're going to start installing 
B4, B5. B4 goes in first. The numbering is such that the lowest brace would be one to the high, and the uh, highest number would be the top brace. It's also recommended that you don't force everything. It's very precision. Uh, if you're forcing it, you're doing it wrong. Corey's putting this thing together, take a moment to notice where all the uh, white uh, tie straps are located. Uh, that's important. What you're viewing right now would be the inside of the triangle. 